Hey guys, what's going on? I'm Leah and you're watching Glamour Gadgets and Gaming by Leah. So guys, recently we've seen plenty of smartphones with the best cameras, but have you seen one which not only has a 256 megapixel camera mode, has the best powerful CPU and GPU for gaming, and is also packed with some exclusive technology and all for a very competitive price and is the best gaming smartphone of 2020 so far. I did not think it would get better than the ROG 2 from last year, which was a powerhouse. However, Xiaomi with its Black Shark 3 has surprised me. I have spent hours and hours gaming on it, something I rarely get time for. And no exaggeration guys, I think I'm becoming an addict. This phone makes me want to game all day. I know for sure by the end of this video most of you guys will agree with me on the fact that the Black Shark 3 not only is the best gaming smartphone I've ever laid my hands on this year but one of the best smartphones of 2020 so far. It's the most affordable phone with the superb Qualcomm Snapdragon 865. The Black Shark 3 has an incredible battery life and gaming focused features. An almost perfect phone for everyone. Today I'll be sharing with you this portable gaming beast, the Xiaomi Black Shark 3, a bunch of accessories to go with it, lots of COD, PUBG and Asphalt Gaming, some pictures and video comparisons to the Huawei P40 Pro 5G camera, Leah's pros and cons and so on. I also have an international surprise giveaway which I will be announcing towards the end of this video so stick around. I won't go into detail with the specs as I'm sure you guys have already seen some unboxings and reviews on this beast. Check out the specs on the screen in front of you. The Black Shark 3 has a beautiful 6.67 inches AMOLED bezel-less 90Hz display with 1080 by 2400 pixels. The Xiaomi Black Shark 3 has a solid aluminium body with a Gorilla glass front. It has a triple camera setup with 64 megapixel, 13 megapixel and a 5 megapixel primary camera and 20 megapixel single selfie camera. Now we'll go into more detail with the camera later on in the video. This beast is powered by the Qualcomm Snapdragon 865 chipset with octa-core CPU and Adreno 650 GPU. It runs on Android 9 and comes with a 4720 milliamp non-removable battery. It has a very symmetrical design making it grippy and easy to control no matter how you hold it. The 270Hz touch refresh rate allows fast triggers and most fluid swipe ever with your fingers. With the 90Hz high refresh rate you're looking at and holding a total mesmerizing portable gaming beast. Thanks to the Qualcomm Snapdragon 865, the Black Shark 3 is snappy fast. The combined powerful CPU, GPU and 5G system allows for an extremely breathtaking, hassle-free, smooth gaming, streaming, data transfer and browsing experience. Packed with a 12GB RAM and a 256GB maximum SSD storage, this is plentiful for a disturbance-free and hassle-free smartphone and gaming experience. Guys, the technology in this phone is phenomenal. The Master Touch 3.0 gives you two extra pressure-sensitive hotkeys with just a simple press on the screen. Black Shark's revolutionary sandwich liquid cooling system allows for heat to spread across each end of the phone simultaneously, resulting in high cooling efficiency. We have LPDDR5 RAM along with Ultrafast UFS 3.0, which allow quick loading and speedy gaming, fast data transfer, fast installation, uploading games and switching between scenes is quick and sharp. Sniper. 
The Black Shark 3 has the world's first dual battery system. It has a series charging and parallel discharging. Now 12 minute charge gives us an amazing 50% battery life and a mere 38 minute charge gives us 100% battery life. Although the battery all sounds technical, but I can say that the charge speed is incredible and the battery life is one of the best I have experienced on a smartphone, easily lasting me around two days with regular use from a full charge. This phone supports NSA and SA 5G networks. Furthermore, dual channel connection makes it possible for both 5G plus Wi-Fi 6 with dual X antenna to stay connected simultaneously, which in return outputs very stable connection for every second of use. The Black Shark 3's gaming screen has a refresh rate of 90 Hz. The MEMC technology powered by the independent image chipset boosts even the lowest quality videos, giving you smooth and immersive 90 Hz viewing and gaming experience. The 6.67 inch large AMOLED screen on the Black Shark 3 has one of the highest colour accuracies. With Delta E and JNCD technology, you are able to see the real colours in the games and videos you play. The True View display on the Black Shark 3 adjusts both the brightness and the colour temperature of the screen to match the surrounding ambient light, allowing more of natural view on the display. Based on Android 9, the latest Joy UI 11 combines the greatest mobile OS and the most professional gaming experience. I quite like it guys, it's very responsive, there are no significant bloatware apps that I could find. The all new Shark Space provides the richest gaming features including Shark Time, Ludicrous Mode, Gaming Studio etc and allows maximum system customization for us gamers. By default guys, when you enter a game through Sharkspace, it will clear all the memory and reject any phone calls. You can then set up various other settings, for example, you can limit what is shown from notifications and also disable full screen gestures and navigation buttons, etc. So guys, when you're in a game, you can swipe down to open up a gaming control panel. So when you're in this guys, this allows you to adjust any gaming settings. You have two front facing stereo speakers, one here at the top and one at the bottom, which output equally balanced, crisp quality and very immersive stereo audio experience. As mentioned earlier, the Black Shark 3 equips a triple camera setup, a 64 megapixel main camera, a 13 megapixel ultra wide snapper and a five megapixel bokeh camera. This phone is not really targeted at the photography enthusiasts. Whilst the camera is not bad at all, it can't compete with the other phones around this price point and power. I would say the Huawei P40 Pro 5G and the likes of the Realme X50 Pro for example feature far superior phone cameras, but these definitely do not compete when it comes to incredible gaming capabilities displayed by the Black Shark 3. The video on the Black Shark 3 can go up to 4K at 60 frames per second, but I personally feel the 1080p at 30 frames per second video footage is more quality, quite smooth, with less jitter and more stableness. And hidden in the pro mode, we also have an option for 256 megapixel shots.
the photo quality on the Black Shark 3 is incredible. Now guys, check out the P40 Pro 5G comparison pictures and videos. Which ones look better to you? Do share your thoughts in the comment box below. Audio on both phones is fantastic and almost identical, with audio on the Black Shark 3 sounding a little more sharper, clear and crisp. And guys, can you tell the difference? Black Shark 3's footage is more vibrant, some may say it's too much, reds are a little pushed. Personally guys, I feel there's a decent detailed balance and maybe with a little software update, this may be perfected. I feel both cameras are doing a great job. The Huawei P40 Pro seems to provide more consistent, stable and reliable footage, whereas the Black Shark 3 slightly slacks in stabilisation. In my opinion, the Huawei P40 Pro pictures look noticeably much cooler, whereas the pictures in the Xiaomi Black Shark 3 have a slightly warmer touch. I feel the Black Shark 3 shots look brighter in almost all of the shots, giving an almost HDR-like processing. Some may say the shots look slightly unnatural, however, in comparison to the Huawei P40 Pro, the Black Shark 3 shot both close up and from a distance look almost as sharp and good and both are pleasing to the eye. Check out that edge detection on the Black Shark 3, those textures which are smooth but not overly exaggerated. These daytime shots on the P40 Pro seem more softer whereas the Black Shark 3 outcome is sharp and enhanced but do not look so unnatural. Overall, both cameras are doing a fantastic job. Which camera do you prefer and why? Jot your answers in the comment box below. As for accessory guides, we have plenty. Here we have the Black Shark Fun Cooler Pro, which allows 14 degrees Celsius drop in temperature in around one minute. This has some advanced TEC technology, including the iPhone 11 Pro Max, the Huawei P40 Pro 5G, the OnePlus 8 and so on. It features iOS and Android app management. Check out these really cool funky RGB lights. Although I've not had the need for this fan as the Black Shark 3 is packed with some amazing cooling technology. It is quite cool and fascinating. Look at these RGB lights guys. And once switched on, the fan does feel quite powerful and there is noticeable cooling around my hands and a drop in temperature whilst gaming. It feels almost ice cold when touching it. It is very small and portable and not very noisy when switched on. Here we have the Black Shark Gamepad 3, which features a press in joystick, classic control aiming, long endurance, it definitely is small and portable and is directly compatible with the Black Shark 3 or the 3 Pro and can also be used with any other Black Shark phone via an adapter. The Black Shark magnetic charging cable features magnetic connection, direct charge, allows for unobstructed gaming and guide provides 18 watts fast charging. Guys, I played several games including COD, PUBG and Asphalt for plentiful hours and I've experienced no lags, jitters, slowdown or any other issues with the Black Shark 3's performance.
if you're after a powerful gaming fan, you guys best agree that the Qualcomm Snapdragon 865 is your best bet when it comes to gaming especially. We've not had many of Snapdragon 865 phones launched yet and guys, especially here in the UK. Furthermore, if you want to buy something relatively affordable, I personally do not feel that it gets any better than the Black Shark 3 with an official UK price of £539. This is the cheapest flagship phone on the market in 2020 so far. The Black Shark 3 is an excellent consideration for an affordable flagship. And as I've just mentioned, although it does fall a little behind in the camera department, when compared to the more camera targeted expensive phones, its gaming orientated features give it the advantage for any gamer over the Huawei P40 Pro, OnePlus and the Realme. Some may argue that the Red Magic 5G is better, but guys, I'm not sure. I've not used it. Have you? Share your opinions in the comment box below. I know for sure that the Red Magic 5G is not readily available here in the UK, for example, giving the Black Shark 3 a slight upper hand. The Black Shark 3 and Pro have very little competition at this price. I've struggled to find any cons in this portable gaming beast. It's a fantastic phone, perfect for gamers and great for anyone else after a powerful, beastie, almost perfect for a very reasonable price smartphone. The Black Shark 3 is priced at £530 here in the UK and around $599 in the US and elsewhere. I have left a link for the phone and the accessories which can be bought separately in the description box below this video. I have got my hands on the Black Shark 3 Pro so guys pop a big capital lettered yes in the comment box below if you guys want to see a video on this. Meanwhile share your thoughts guys what are your feels on the Xiaomi Black Shark 3? Do you like it? Will it be your next purchase? If not why not? And before I go, the surprise international free giveaway. It will be announced on my social media pages in around 24 hours from now. It's a random prize for one random winner. Be sure to like, share, comment and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter, Facebook and Instagram to stand a chance to win this. And to be notified of my upcoming videos, giveaways, etc. That's me done for now guys. Thank you so much for watching. Until the next one, take care. Bye.